Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Disney Dust. It's Disney Dwayne here, and we are going to be reviewing, as you saw earlier, Go the Distance. I love it. It is the song title. I can go the distance, and it's the twisted tale, this time around, written by Jen Kalonita. And uh, it says here, what if Meg had to become a Greek god? It doesn't say what if Meg became a god. It says what did what if Meg had to become a god? So this whole adventure is basically Meg having to become a god and what she has to go through to become a god, which is very interesting. We all love Megara, well, I do at least. Um, I can't get enough of her. There was not enough of her sass in the original movie. So I love that this book actually focuses not so much on Hercules, but it actually focuses more on Megara and, um, we all love Susan Egan. Well, again, I do. Uh, Susan Egan is the the voice actor and the singer of Megara in Hercules, the animated movie. Uh, she's also the original Belle on Broadway uh, for the Disney theatrical version of it. So I've had I have a history with Susan Egan. I love her. She is amazing, and it's great that there's a whole focus on her character here. There's so many lines in the book that I I just want to have her. You know, I want to hear her say it. I almost want to send her copies of these lines for her to say. Maybe at some point I will, and I'll feature them here. Who knows? Um, I am in a little bit of contact with her. She is very, also very, very friendly and very open. And uh, we've talked se on several occasions and even met. Um, so it's no doubt that we delve into Megara's last name. And guess, guess her last name. Just guess. I'm sure it's a tribute. Yes, Megara Egan is... Um, <laughs> is is her last name so um i think i think jen knows this um and put that in there just amazing it makes me so happy um also we get a little bit more on um you know uh the gods in this in this world that that jen has created we we see a little bit more of the relationships uh between the gods and what it's like to live up there um and uh, we delve a little further into well the future of meg and hercules what happens and not only that we also delve back into the past where she uh megara has to you know there's a bit of backstory about her mom uh, as well as uh, what happened to her uh, why she ended up um with hades which is all very nice i love i love how how they took the opportunity to put everything and tie everything together so so, you know, amazing points for that. Uh, however, towards the ending, um, you know, um, I'm going to spoil the territory. So I guess basically Meg fails the quest towards the end to become a god. And of course, no Disney story can end unhappily. So um, it's a little bit predictable that she gets her happy ending. So that part, I, I thought there was it was a bit predictable and maybe there was there could have been another way to have um you know made it a little bit more surprising for the readers maybe um so there are a couple of predictable things just two things i can't remember the other one right now but you know the, the story wrapped up um oh yeah and how how you know how her mom and uh this child uh the sister of the girlfriend of her ex-boyfriend, it's complicated, uh, ended up together in 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 hell, I think. Um, so anyways, um, what I thought, I, I would give this book a three out of five. I mean, I really enjoyed it, uh, but there's just a couple of things, you know, story-wise that could have been uh, less predictable. And of course, um, yeah, but I did, I did like the, the meaningful, the meaningful mother-daughter uh, relationship, which could have been, ex been explored a little bit more. But but it was there, and it was um, a, a mirror and a parallel to another mother mother daughter relationship within the book. So that was nice. Um, yeah. So a few hits and a few misses. So that's why it's three out of five. Uh, what did you think about it? Are you gonna go read it now? Um, yes. Follow along for more reviews, and of course, do give this a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Catch you next time. Bye.